A new exhibition in Denver explores the inventions of Leonardo da Vinci and how they influence our modern lives. I had a really great opportunity to check out Da Vinci X, the Machines and You exhibition. Leonardo da Vinci is one of the most well-known artists in the world, but he's also an incredible inventor. Here inside the Da Vinci X exhibit, you get to walk in his shoes. Joining me now is one of the curators, Mark Rogers. Buongiorno, Hi, buongiorno. Thank you so much for coming by today. <laughs> that accent is so good. Uh, we get to walk in his shoes, and I know this is one of da Vinci's most famous creations. What are we looking at here? Yes, he, da Vinci had over 44,000 inventions, of which only 14,000 survived. This is his portable bridge, and actually, you get, we can put it together at the exhibit. Want to help him put it together? Well, I do see that you have this, and I know families can come in. This is a very interactive exhibit. So tell us about how you're putting this together. Yes, we, um, it, it, it's very easily, Da Vinci said the simplest design was the most elegant, and here you can help me. What we do is we, 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 put, put, we put on these two long rails, okay. and then you will lift up the inside. Just like this. The other that side, and then I insert this into the notch. Perfect. And then this was designed for wow. soldiers to take with them on long trucks and journeys, wow. and then after they used it, they'd pack it up and take it with them so it wouldn't be around for the enemy to use later. You know, Da Vinci is a master in engineering, but we also know that he is truly a genius in mechanics. What you're looking at spinning is the first rendering of a helicopter, again designed by Leonardo da Vinci. He envisioned this operating by men to stand on this platform, hold on to these bars, and literally run around in a circle in an attempt to air screw up into the air like our present day helicopter. And what is really unique about this is that it's an interactive exhibit. So da Vinci was one of the first to create the gear. He's also behind what we know as the flywheel. When you crank it like this and put the two together, you can understand how all that is a part of what we know as our car engine. How does Leonardo da Vinci play into a 3D printer? Here from the Colorado School of Mines is Michaela Heinemann to tell us how. Yeah, so da Vinci's designs are seen in here as the worm screw, the gear drive, and really just the way the printer moves around to make our designs. That is amazing. And the kids get to come in here and play around with this. What are they learning? They get to learn the basic 3D printing process as well as get inspiration for their own designs and how they can make their ideas a reality. It never ceases to amaze me how the ancient works of da Vinci are a part of our modern day world. Mm -hmm. The Da Vinci X exhibition will be at the Denver Pavilions for the next six months, and we do have information about admission fees and special performances on our website, cbsdenver.com. How cool is that?